Coverage winter not done with us yet. Channel 3's Bryant Reed live in the early warning weather tracker with the check of the roads and how people are getting ready for that snow coming into state. Bryant, where are you? What are you seeing? Well, Stephanie, right now we just got on I-84 East, headed from Waterbury towards Hartford. And so far, all things considered, the roads are looking good. I'll go ahead and change this camera here so you can see what they're looking like. You can see, the, uh, of course, the roads are a little rainy, but uh, that's to be expected with the weather. Now, it can take a lot to keep the roads in shape, especially uh, with the mix of rain and snow that we're going to get. And we had a chance to talk to the Public Works Department in Waterbury who says uh, that's a full-time effort for them when you don't know what to expect. Old Man Winter isn't done having his fun with Connecticut just yet. It's not uncommon to see the expected three to five inches of snow in March, but many expected it to come much earlier in the season. Waterbury Public Works Director David Simpson says they're still trying to do their due diligence. We do go out and check what we'll call our hot spots where we might have some uh, normal water runoff to pre-treat some of those conditions um, before the rain comes. He says pre-treating with this weather can be difficult. If you use salt and it rains first, the salt is ineffective. And it's moms like Emily Tavares who don't play when it comes to bad weather. So um, I've actually previously had two accidents due to the snow. Um, so I try to ma maintain home. Um, we actually have like weather covers for our car so that you know it makes it a little bit easier to clean up. She was just stocking up at the grocery store when we caught up with her. In fact, she says they changed her one year old's birthday party so nobody has to go out and can stay inside and be safe. We planned on um, taking him to the aquarium, of course, tomorrow, but during that time is will be snow. So um, aside from that, we'll be, you know, staying probably staying home and changing our plans to Sunday. But for those who are out late Friday night or Saturday morning, a word of advice from Public Works. It may not freeze on every road, but you will have some icy spots. So I would always ask drivers, take your time, slow down. It's good for you, it's good for the other motorists, and it allows our staff to get out do there and do their job. Now, once again, a quick check of the roads here on I-84 East from Waterbury to Hartford. Uh, like I mentioned before, they're really not too bad with this weather. And at least here in uh, Waterbury, Public Works Director says that they're prepared for the rain and the snow. They say that they always keep a mixture of salt and sand on them just to handle any condition. Reporting the early warning weather tracker, I'm Brian Creed, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Brian, thank you. Hartford St. Patrick.